Greetings citizens of the world. The following is a thought exercise, it's simply requested that you listen carefully to what's being said. It can be assumed that the statement, we need global government reform, resonates in some way with most people. Typically most people would agree that policy changes are needed to address issues such as the economy, war, education, etc. Though would it not be incorrect to say that by looking for global government reform, we are in fact the ones calling for a new world order? By its very definition we are changing the current world order and creating a new one. Therefore it can be argued that we do indeed need a new world order and that the name is simply that. A name, not the definition. What's the point behind this? Names. We label so many things to justify our own views. Though the world isn't black and white, it's many shades of grey, with many interpretations of what's right and what's wrong. For example, I may say DDoS attacks are a legit form of protest, though does that make it morally right? Who decides if it's morally wrong? Each of us has our own definitions for everything. Anonymous is simply a name, always remember that. We can be glorified, or vilified using it. Some may claim Anonymous is the CIA and they may be correct, there's nothing stopping the CIA from using the name. Some may claim Anons are saviors and they may be correct, angels, so to speak, very well may help from the shadows. Nonetheless, Anonymous, just like the term New World Order, is simply a name. It can have many definitions and mean many different things. Never follow a name blindly. Always use your own judgment to determine what's morally right and wrong. Be it religion, the government, or secret societies like Anonymous, you control your own destiny, don't simply be a follower. Dare to dream beyond. We are Anonymous. We are Legion. We can forgive. Though we shall never forget. Expect us.